What's up, bro? It's Luke, and welcome to my 2024 apartment tour. Come on in. So as you know, we moved a couple of months ago and this place is finally furnished. So let me show you around. By the way, I'm living with a roommate. He's behind the camera. His name is Milo. He doesn't want to show himself, but he's behind the camera. Anyways, let's get straight to it. So here we just got a bunch of jackets and our shoes and stuff. And my Air Forces have definitely seen better days. And this part of the entrance is still under construction. As you can see, we just got this light here. But just imagine we got a bench and a mirror here. Moving on here, we just got a closet. And basically, it's just filled with bunch of shit we didn't know where else to add. So don't worry about this. Nothing interesting in there. But then if you turn around, let's get into the bathroom. So here's the bathroom. Honestly, it's a pretty average bathroom. But a couple of things I want to show you in here. Come on in. So here we got the shelf. It's just filled with my roommate's skincare products. I don't even know what half of this shit is. And also the floor isn't flat. So we had to put these things, whatever these things are called, to make this stand straight. Then let's get to this side. Here we got a couple of shelves. Basically just filled with like hair dryers and things of this nature. And if we go down, here we just got my hygiene and skincare stuff but honestly i think it's a scam because ever since i started using these things my acne just broke out even more so i don't know if it's working properly or not here we got our toilet and in here we just got our shower nothing fancy about it then let's get to the main part of the apartment come on in So in here we just aim for a minimalistic style. I don't know if we achieved that goal or not. So first things first, we got this coffee machine here. Y'all roasted me so much about my energy drink consumption in my day in the life videos that I had to get one. And honestly, it's been life changing. So thank you so much for calling me out on that. Then next to the coffee machine, we got all these coffee pods so we don't get bored of the same ones. And my favorite at the moment is probably this cold brew one. It's really good. And down here we got a dishwasher. It's on right now so I can show you. But having one is such a luxury. In my last place I didn't have one. Saves so much time and energy. And on the upper cabinets we just got plates, glasses, regular shit bro. Then moving on. Here we got all our supplements from protein powder to vitamins. Currently I'm only taking protein powder, creatine and multivitamin. So let me know in the comments what I should add to the stack. In here we just got a bunch of spices my roommate likes to cook and we're not into that boiled chicken with salt so we need a lot of seasoning. All right here's our induction stove and our oven. Then here's our fridge you know now that I'm all mature and stuff we try to cook more at home so the fridge needs to be kept full at all times. And by the way if you're addicted to soda please get yourself some sparkling water. I used to be super addicted to 7-ups but now when I'm craving soda I just pop one of these. And down here is our freezer we basically only use it for making ice cubes for the coffee. And the last part about the kitchen here we got our dry storage, just like rice, pasta, nothing too interesting in there. And here's my roommate's room, but it's his private space, so let's not go in there. So this side of the living room was way too naked, so we got this bamboo shelving here. It was like 50 bucks, really good investment actually. And on the shelf itself, we got these lava stones. These just bring a nice scent to the whole living room. Also, you can pick your own scent. We went with this vanilla one. It's really good for the winter. Also, we got a fruit bowl. It adds a little bit of life to the living room and some nice colors. And on the second shelf, we just got a bunch of alcohol. I'm actually not an alcoholic. That's what every alcoholic says. But trust me, I'm not. My favorite ones are this whiskey and this Singani Aventura. So basically, this is my roommate's project. They make this in Bolivia and they send it here. And it's actually really fucking good. And on the third shelf, we just got this light. It has a nice mood in here when it's dark outside and stuff. Moving on, we got my favorite part of the living room. This sofa is from Ikea, actually. It was like 300 bucks. And I was just working here, so that's why my laptop is here. But just imagine, me and the bros chilling here, watching some UFC, eating some nice meal, things of this nature. Or even just chilling here and reading a book. But this section of the living room isn't actually finished. We still need to add like a painting here. So just imagine there's a cool anime painting right here. Then also, we got a football here. You know, I used to play football for like... 14 years, so we had to get one of these. And then moving on. Honestly, I don't know what this area is supposed to be, but we just threw our dining table here. It's actually pretty nice just eating here and watching the view. Actually, let me show you the view from the dining room. Sheesh, it's crazy. But then behind you, we got this TV and the TV stand. It's a pretty nice TV, 65 inches from Philips. Also has these lights in the back. Honestly, we probably overpaid like 80 bucks for the lights, but let's not talk about that, bro. A nice little detail, this TV stand matches the bamboo vibe with the shelf back there. And also, just imagine this corner looks like this. <whistles> then, bro, let me show you around my man cave. Come on in. <laughs> then. 
Then on the entrance we got this fake plant just to add some color to this place. And on the wall we got the most basic tech lifestyle YouTuber calendar. It's called the standard calendar but honestly it looks really good so I had to buy one. And if we go this way, here we just got a bunch of closets. Here's all my clothes. Honestly it's looking pretty organized, I'm surprised of myself. And in here we just got a couple of jackets, my bathrobe, some shirts, things of this nature and a bunch of shit up here. Also do what the sign says but then let's get to the shelf. So on the upper shelf we got my fragrances. This one's really good, I really like this one. Then here we got another fake plant, just to add some color, you know what I'm saying? And we got this remote for the flashbang on the desk. Then we got a diffuser, this humidifies the air and also adds a nice scent to her room. So if you get lucky and a girl is coming over, please get one of these, she'll be impressed bro. Moving on, we got a digital clock, it just fits the vibe and looks real cool, so I added it there. Also on this shelf we got the box for my watch and this stone plate, it just holds my jewelry and things of this nature. And yeah, that's pretty much it for the shelf, but if you want to spice up your room or your room is boring, get one of these, it really adds a nice vibe to your room. Moving on, I'm not gonna do a setup tour in this video, but here's a little sneak peek of the setup. And this is where no magic happens actually. But this section I wanted to keep empty so I can just walk up to the window and look at the view. Actually, let me show you something, come here. So you see those buildings down there? That's where I was working construction a couple of years ago for minimum wage. So it's pretty cool to see how much things can change in only a couple of years, bro. And that's it for the apartment tour. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Also, Merry Christmas, my brother, and I'll see you in the next one.